All right, still on the entertainment news, Mr. Ibu's family provides health updates. The family of renowned Nigerian actor John Okafor, a.k.a. Mr. Ibu, have provided an update regarding his ailments. In a post shared on his Instagram page, the family stated that the ailing actor has so far gone through five successful surgeries and is still recuperating in the intensive care unit. The post read, and I quote, We want to thank God and most especially the general public for their support, encouragement and prayers during this trying period for our dad. We called on good Nigerians and we were very grateful for the response in every aspect, most especially the donations. It came in very timely and very helpful. So far, Daddy has gone through five successful surgeries and he's still recovering in the ICU. Daddy is immensely grateful and we are thankful to the general public during this phase of our lives. We appreciate all the donations made to this account. And soon as daddy is better, he will personally acknowledge all donations respectively. We are still counting on all your prayers and unwavering support. As we pray, he gets stabilized quickly to enable us to fly him abroad for further advanced treatment. The John Okafor family is grateful to all Nigerians, end quote. If you would recall sometime last month, Mr. Ibu came out to seek public assistance as he battles an ailment that may cost him his leg. In a video shared on his Instagram page, the actor said he has been down for so many weeks and had been on admission. He said the medical doctors have said that if they exhaust the options they have, they might resort to cutting off his leg. He then asked Nigerians to pray for him and also support him financially while sharing his account details. So this is uh, another one that I've been following closely. We've all been following mm -hmm. and I'm really glad with the process and the progress. Yeah. Even though there has been a lot of back and forth, people calling people out and people clearing people. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, I'm just glad that he has been able to undergo the surgeries he needs. Mm -hmm. And hopefully he's fit enough to be flown out of the country yeah. so he doesn't lose his legs. Because first off, they said that they, they advised um, them to cut off his toes, but he said no. And then it, it, it moved gradually to he has to amputate his legs. And I'm like, what's mm -hmm. going on? But now he's recovering. I just wish him quick recovery and hope that all the surgeries are going to be successful. Yeah, so I just want to give a huge shout out to Nigerians for this one. Um, as much as we feel like, you know, the country is bad, yep. people don't really have money and mm -hmm. all that, I like the way Nigerians in situations where it is extremely yes. needed and then they are sure of, Nigerians find a way to pull through, rally around and yep. do this because it's very easy to just see the story and say, hey, yeah, and scroll away. But I mean, um, to all the people who donated, to yep. all the people who showed love, you know, posted and did all of that, um, just we just want to say thank you for that. Um, your love and help doesn't yep. go unnoticed. Yep. And I pray that God is going to replenish you guys' pockets. Yeah, I'm just... Amen. 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 Yeah. Amen. <laughs> All right, people, that is all we can take on the entertainment news. We have got Socialville coming up right after this break, so do not go anywhere.